Hello, Pokemon fans! I'm Professor K. And I'm Ben. And we are back with our third straight week in a row of Mega Mailbox Mania Monday. This is number 31. Surprisingly, we've got enough mail to do yet another one, so it... Yeah, I've lost track. I thought it was like 35, 30, 29. I don't know. Can you even count that high? Can you? Yes. Can you? Prove it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. You skipped like five <laughs> numbers there. I just said them really fast. Anyways, guys, we are here with Mega Mailbox Mania number 31. We have 10 submissions, so we're going to jump right in here and get started. First up, we have an FCBM from Pokemon Collector 379. Open me, please. Smurfist. Actually, it says open on camera, please. Oh. Yeah. This is actually a PokeTuber that we met in Tampa at a pre-release, and they moved to another state. So, no longer in our area, but I uh, did meet them at a pre-release in Tampa. So, here we go. We got a note that says, hey guys, I hey. really... Hi. <laughs> really like your videos when you open... Uh, wait a minute. I really like your videos. When you open this, see who cries first. Oh man, this sounds like it's going to be interesting. <laughs> The one dollar is a donation to the channel. Let the Aw, thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, let the games begin. Okay, now I'm scared. Now I'm really scared. I'm scared, sickened, yet intrigued. <laughs> Pokemon Collector three seven nine explains my history with the internet. Very true. And Jack Attack. So we have some business cards here. Here you go. Pokemon Collector three seven nine battles with opening chips. Opening battles, deck reviews, recaps, TCGO, tags, vlogs, and event. Is there anything on the back? Nope. Okay. So we got a few of these cards, actually. That's really cool. There we go. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. See, I can at least count to nine. That's cool. There's the proof. So there's that. Awesome looking business cards. And it looks like we have N hashtag slow blow. No! Noel A. There's the dollar. So oh, thank really you very much. I put my name? Yep. And look, Red Professor K. Slow blow. And no Chris. How about that? <laughs> All right. Jerk. You go ahead and open up yours first. Uh, all right. I'm gonna open it yet. Yeah, cover these. There you go. All right. Actually, at some point, you may need the sword from what I read on the back of one of these envelopes, so you might have to go and get it during uh, a portion where I'm opening something. Okay, okay. All right. Oh, what is that? That was not. That was not me. I swear. There's a ripped card in there. Oh man, what is it? Oh, <laughs> you don't rip this. Yes, yes, that is incredible. No, no, no. why rip that? <laughs> okay, let's see what these cards are. Oh no, ew. Oh, ew. <laughs> <laughs> well, if that's what you got, I can only imagine what's in my envelope. I didn't cry. I did not cry. I'm not going to cry either, I promise you. So I'm going to guess there's a ripped Halucha and a whole bunch of Helioptile. That's just... Yeah, there's... There's... Oh, there it is. Ripped Halucha. <laughs> I'm okay with this. I mean, Halucha's nice, but, I mean, it doesn't break my heart. There you go. That restores my heart, seeing him ripped. <laughs> and, Yay. yeah, there we go. Out of here, out of here, out of here. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here, and get out of here. Oh, well, thank you for thinking of us anyways. We appreciate the dollar. <laughs> uh, all right, and why don't you open up this? This is an FCBM from Justin Paul. M. It's from Paul? Also cool. known as Paul. Justin Paul. Guess I'm supposed to read this first. Note, thank you! Give me the scissors. Scissors! <sighs> uh, go back to school, would you? Which is ironic because you're in school and I'm not. Yep. Hey, Prof Can and I've been watching for around a week and I enjoyed the interaction between the two of you. I'm sending a mix of my unused cards. Yeah, unused cards I've been collecting off and on for eight years. My recent obsession has been with Eevee and it's Eevee Lucian's only missing two. I'm also sending an old school metal coin. Ooh, that's awesome. You're a fan. Paul Justin. <laughs> P.S. Long live Primal Fish and Sparkle Army. Yeah! He knows what it's all about. I can attest to that. There's Paul knows what it's all about. 
There's a metal coin in here. If there's a, if it's the metal coin I'm thinking of, that is incredible because I've always wanted one of those metal coins. Well, too bad because it's mine. It's ours. Mine. Ours. Oh, oh man, I can't wait to see this because I've only ever seen one in person. Are metal coins are the official metal coins allowed? They are still allowed. They are official Pokemon coins. They are usable in tournament play. Oh, there it goes. It's under. Uh. I got it. Thing is, I'm just trying to cut this without damaging anything. Yep, oh, you should be okay. So there's the back of it. There's Pokemon. And yes, it's the Lugia oh, one. Oh, that's so cool. Oh man, look at that. Oh, this is so neat. That is All amazing. Right. So we have N and Pro of K and a bunch of stuff here. Here. You take this. Still a solid metal coin. And let's go, let's go over these first. So in this package here, we have Scyther. Base set two. Ooh, plus power. Plus power. And, ooh, wow, that's a Japanese <sighs> Neo Discovery Crobat, I believe. Oh, man. Imagine if these were still grass types to this day. Oh, my gosh. Could you imagine bats with forest and giant plants? Ugh. Oh. Okay, I, I regret saying that. I just scared myself. That's gross. <laughs> All right, we have EX Delta Species with Beedrill, Dual Typing, and a Kingdra. Fire and metal. Delta Species Dual Typing. Cool, cool. Put those to the side. Awesome era. All right. Doc Vaporeon. Team Rocket? Yes. Doc Flareon. Also Team Rocket. And Cyclone Energy. What's that's that from? I can't even see it. Uh, EX Power Keepers, I think? No, that's Dragon... No, that's not Dragon Frontier. Oh my Fracture. god. Fracture! That's one of the uh, Play Pokemon promos. Yep, and Doc Jolteon. Goes with the rest of the evolutions. Yep, yep. So, you can go ahead and open your little pack first. Okay, so Prof K here. Looks like there's two or three cards in here. I think there's only two. Yep, there's two. All right, so this card is a pincer from Jungle. Pince, 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 pincer. And a Butterfree from the Southern Islands collection. Very nice. And I don't get to see these very often. I used to have a Togepi. Uh, not a, I'm sorry, a Meryl. I think I still do have it. I had Meryl sign it at Worlds 2014, and it's still in my binder over there to this day. Very cool uh, collection of cards. If you put them all together, the pictures in each of them create like a uh, collage of a scene from, um, what is it? One of the little short feature things, oh, whatever really? it is. Yeah, it That's creates it really creates a cool. picture. Yeah, it's really cool. All right, very cool. Thank you very much. All right, and let's see what dear old end guy and his thing here. Matter of fact, I'm gonna see if I can hunt down All that right. Meryl that was signed by Meryl. So we got <gasps> sparkles and nugget. Ah, Nuggets and sparkles. Ah, this is so awesome. I tell you though, when Fates Collect comes out, I cannot wait for the Sparkles EX. I have a plan with that deck. The Sparkle Army guys. <laughs> It's coming to TCG. It's coming <laughs> to TCG. Here we go. What I was talking to you guys earlier, this is actually a Japanese version, but it is a Meryl, and I had it signed by Meryl in there at Worlds. But that's also from the Southern Islands collection. Just the Japanese version, though. Alrighty. And I believe that was it from yep, that. that is it. So thank you very much, Justin. While I show off this TCBM from Trainer Ash Fry, you should go get your sword, because you're going to need it. Oh, okay. Potentially. Just from what, from what I saw from the back of the envelope. All right, Trainer Ashfry and I made a trade. I sent him the cards uh, that I pulled out of what was supposed to be, I'm gonna may as well just say it now, what was supposed to be Two-Pack Tuesday for next week. The problem is, is the files are corrupted and the Holon Phantoms and the Dragon Frontiers pack did not make it. Uh, I could not save the files. So, unfortunately, we're gonna have to switch to something else for Two-Pack Tuesday tomorrow, the final episode. Maybe, who knows? But I may as well tell you guys, I pulled a uh, Needle King Hollow from Dragon Frontiers and nothing out of the uh, Holland Phantoms. So there's the spoiler on that, even though it's not technically a spoiler because you're not going to find out anyways. But I traded him the Needle King and also the Reverse Deoxys that you saw me pull last week with the Mudkip Gold Star. All right, so here we have Charmander with his signature card, Ash Fry. And I think there's a card on the other side. There is. Oh, very cool. Okay, it's a Fighting Energy from Generations. Not bad, not bad. We also have a Reverse Hollow Grass Energy from Generations as well. This is what I traded Ooh, for. Ooh, pretty. Yep, so we are very close to a Master Set of Generations now. Matter of fact, at the end of this, you guys will know that we do have a completed set. 
but that's just to, uh, you'll see which last card that is here shortly. So thank you very much for the trade, uh, Ash, Fry, thank you very much. And next up here, I think we're going to open up this TCBM. From Boros. This is from Boros. He is a technical part of the meta deck. Um, he's done stuff for them, uh, written articles and stuff like that. So I did a trade with him. There is a note, first and foremost. All right. Hey, Professor K and N, I just wanted to say... Hey. <laughs> Thank you guys for doing this trade with me. Professor K actually had some of the stuff I needed slash wanted, which worked out really well. Or worked out really not only my side of the trade, but his. So, hey, it's a win-win for both of us. Inside the top loaders are what we traded for, but the special pack marked with the big fat letter N is for N to open. Woo! And you have to do the pack trick for these. On top of that, the last three cards N must also sign for me and be returned. And N, I want legitimate signatures on these. I just wanted to help you guys out, and I've been watching you guys for a little while now since I'm also good friends with the meta deck, which Professor K chilled with during states, uh, Florida states. Anyway, though, enjoyed the cards, and I hope to hear from you guys soon. Sincerely, Boros PS. Empoleon is my favorite Pokemon. Empoleon's solid. I'm actually trading him, I believe, a secret rare Empoleon part for some of this stuff. Cool. All right. So this is yours. I will show you guys what the trade was for. I guess I need my scissors, not scissors. Yeah, not that. There's that. This metal coin is so oh. cool. Well, you guys already saw it. <laughs> Jolteon! We traded for this awesome Jolteon EX, a highly valuable card right now in uh, Generations. It's very hard to pull. We've only gotten one of them. And there seems to be a card behind it, actually. I didn't notice that before. Oh, Reverse Psychic Energy. That's right. I forgot I traded for this, too. This is going towards the Master Set as well. Mainly we got this card because of how good it is competitively. With Flash Ray, 70 damage during your opponent's next turn. Prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks from basic Pokemon. Very, very good. So we got that. And we also have two other top loaders here that have cards that are valuable in it. I'm not sure if anyone that is watching this is aware, but VS Seeker has jumped in value by quite a bit recently. Although I don't know how long that's going to stick around because I think it's going to go back down very soon. Reprints. Yeah, potential reprints. Um, we do have two VS Seeker in this one, and then there should be, if I'm not mistaken, VS Seeker. Two more VS Seeker in here. I sent him a. What did I send him? Seeker Rare Empoleon. Full art. No, not full art. Uh, I think it was a Hoopa. No, two full art Primal Groudons. That's what it was. Two full art Primal Groudons and a Secret Rare Empoleon and some strong energy for all of this. So, pretty good trade, anyways, regardless. And, and drop the metal coin. So we have four VS Seekers. Awesome. Can never have too many VS Seekers. And and you're going to open up your little package right here. I can only imagine what's in here. And imagine what cards he wants me to legitimately sign. Yeah, I can only imagine. <laughs> so you got to do the pack trick. Yep, yep. One, two, three, one, two. Boom, boom. <gasps> Esper! Yes. Bill Cosby! <laughs> Feebus. Float on. Slowpoke. Monkey! Ew. Yay! Ew. No! <laughs> oh, oh, wait, oh, wait, wait, oh, wait, wait. Oh, oh, I am oh. so sorry for that. That was a total accident, I swear. Okay. Alright, so what this guy legitimately <laughs> sign. <laughs> eh. <laughs> <laughs> yes! The you card we don't discuss. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, the Halucha EX. No. Shh, shh, shh. This is not. This card doesn't exist. It doesn't exist. Then why is it there? It's a figment of our imagination. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta sign him. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> Can I sign a Helion Tile instead? Uh, no. Anyways, thank you very much for that trade, Boros. Do appreciate that. And I do appreciate the stuff. Appreciate the Esper and all that. Especially the Heliotile. Oh my gosh. Here, and why don't you open up this TCBM from Bayboy that I traded with him. Bayboy? Yeah, he sent us a couple of things, and I sent him a couple things. All right. Yeah, read the note. Okay. Dear N. Oh, why does everyone call me by that name? We are watching you. You have insulted Halucha for the last time 
If you do not embrace his lordship, you will suffer the consequences. If you do not take us serious, any Pokemon harm will be on your hands. From now on, will you respect Halucha? Sincerely, Halucha Army. What the? Hurt you anymore. <laughs> a declaration. A declaration of war has been made. The Sparkle <laughs> Army will not tolerate this. <laughs> All Haluchas will be driven to extinction. I suppose the war is on. We will we will avenge you, my fox brother. Here's what we traded for. No one cares. <laughs> These are the Toys R Us promos. Meowth and Clefairy, be careful with them. Those are not even important. <laughs> well, I mean, at least he cut the bad Zoroark with Corner and Nightclaw from XY. It's... It could have been worse. Okay, but it's still a beautiful card. And he didn't actually cut the Pokemon itself, he just cut the card. So, that's still disrespecting the Zoroark. <laughs> the Haluchas oh, shall man. play the ultimate price. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no. No. I'm not gonna use scissors. Oh geez. Well, while he does that, I will explain to you guys. Uh, we couldn't go to the Toys R Us day that had the Meowth and the Clefairy. We were at Florida States. So because we couldn't go, I sent him some stuff for Greninja deck and a few other trades. And he sent us those. So, um, oh my Mr. gosh. Mr. No. Boy. This oh, no. is my answer to your Halucha army. Oh man. That's intense. It is war now, son. I think we need to put a watch out on our mail now, because I don't know how this is going to go. <laughs> oh, man. Well, thank you, Bay Boy, for sending that. Very much appreciated. Okay, so next up here, I'm going to show you guys a TCBM from my buddy, the Mega Evolution Guru. Fairly new Poketuber, a uh, really good guy though, and has some great content. As a matter of fact, he has a very good announcing voice. Uh, a lot like mine, but I think it actually sounds better. But that's just me. You guys can go check it out for yourself. Any Poketubers in this video will have links in the description down below. Will I have a link? Except for you, because- Give me a link, no fair. You already have his sword, what more do you want? <laughs> <laughs> yes, that was a master sword. Anyways, you guys should go and check him out. Um, really good guy, like I said. Links will be in the description down below to all Poketubers involved in today's Mega Mailbox Mania Monday. So here we go. All right, we have a note, first and foremost. Hello, Professor K and N. In quotations, I see. In parentheses. Quotations. <laughs> I'm a long time viewer of your channel. You are my favorite Poketubers and one of my favorite channels. You guys are actually my biggest inspiration to start my own channel. Yay! We deserve, you deserve more subs than Unlisted Leaf. Well, I don't know about that, but thank you. <laughs> I hope we can trade again soon, and I wish you guys the best of luck, best regards, the Mega Evolution Guru! Because it's in giant letters. P.S. I hate Halucha too. We are officially friends. <laughs> Yes, thank you very much, man. I do appreciate that. It's a very big honor to know that we have inspired you to start your own channel. Um, obviously, I know your channel. I've seen some of your videos, and we've spoken quite a bit. So, um, glad to have known you. Or glad to know you. Not to have known you, because then it means I wouldn't know you anymore. But I do. So, yeah. Shut up. <laughs> Anyways. So, here's what we traded for. This is all towards our master set of um, generations. Let me just fix my uh, power cord there. All right. The so, creep show. we've got ourselves... A reverse hollow Gengar. Is there anything else in there? I think there is. There is. We've got the reverse fairy energy. Very, very nice. That is definitely a very sought after card. Any of the reverse energies are, in my opinion. We got ourselves a reverse hollow team flare grunt. And behind it, we have a reverse hollow butterfree. With quiver dance. This one? We do actually already have a Clefable. I told him we did, but he said, nope, I'm sending it to you anyways. So that's just an extra reverse hollow uncommon for us. And, oh, what is this? What the heck? I did not expect that. Gashomp. Is there something else? I thought there was something else. Okay, cool. Gashomp. Wow, look at this. Gashomp. Gashomp. I don't know what you're doing. Gashomp. <laughs> okay. This is a reverse hollow Garchomp. Gashomp. C. <laughs> Which is just an uncommon from Supreme Victors, but that's a cool card. Surprising Garchomp's an uncommon. Garchomp! <laughs> 
All right, so this is the card that completes our set. Blastoise EX. Bazooka we, Tortoise. We did not pull any of these yet. So that will complete generations for us. Because that guy doesn't like us. And we also traded for yet another Jolteon. So we now have three Jolteons for a potential deck idea. Well, not idea, but a potential deck profile we'll be doing in the future. So there's that. Very nice. Thank you very much for trading for those. And it looks like we have some extras as well. So, and I'm going to let you... Oh, wait. This one actually has your... Is that an M? Are you M now again? M or a three? Oh, it's a three. It's a sideways three. Wow, that looked like an M. Okay, my bad. Well, see, yeah, one, two. I should have looked at the see other two. people, he can't count. Seven? 42. Let me just open <laughs> this one. You're going to start with it? Okay, go for yes. it. Yes. Going backwards here. Nah. Careful. Looks like we got some Japanese cards. Yes, we do. At least one. Or more. Draw it again. And Soul Steel Bud. Since I think we were supposed to open these in order, go with number one next. <laughs> Those are cool hollows, though. They very, are. very cool hollows. Evil Tall is actually my second, no, my third favorite Pokemon. Who's the second favorite? Gengar. Gengar? Ooh! Oh, yes! Reverse Hollow VS Seeker and Muscle Band? Oh, Muscle dude. Band. Dude, that is an, oh, those are some awesome extras for a competitive player anyways. Yup. Yeah, very much appreciated. Thank you so much for those. Let's rip them. What is wrong with you? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? We need firewood to stay warm. Then burn Haluchas and Helioptiles. I'll burn Haluchas. Ooh, and a Fighting Fury Belt? Ew. And another Muscle Band. Wow. Pretty. Those are great. Well, we've got some deck bling now. Thank you very much for sending those. Bling! And, oh, wait, there's one more. Okay. It says last. What could this be? We should have opened this first. You would open it first. There's oh, two whoa, here. I see something shiny. Oh, very nice. Vaporeon EX. Vaporeon and... What? Ooh. Dude. It's full art Z. Very, very nice. As if those reverse hollow rare are... A Z. A Z. What are you doing? A Z. I don't even know what you... Where do you think of these things? A Z. Okay. Yeah, thank you so much for those extras. I mean, the VS Seekers and the Muscle Bands and the Fighting Fury Belt Reverses are awesome enough, but to go above and beyond and to send that full art and a Vaporeon EX, that's just fantastic. Thank you so much, man. Awesome. All right. I'm going to set this actually back here. I didn't want them in the same sleeve facing the same way. That kind of like, ugh, works me. <laughs> Um, next up here, I'm going to show you guys a BCBM. What is BCBM, you may ask? Well, if you've been watching for long enough on the channel, you've probably seen maybe three of these on Mega Mailbox Mini Monday. This is Bought Cards by Mail from Lewis. Lewis actually contacted me via email and told me that he had a Walmart that was selling breakpoint packs for $2 a piece. I was like, wow, that is an incredible deal. And that's when he said, hey, do you want me to pick you up some? Um, yes, please. <laughs> So I sent him the money for these. These were $20 for me to send to him. Plus I paid for his shipping. So it was actually more like $28 or so. But inside here we have, oh my goodness. We have 10 blister packs of Breakpoint. Surprised he didn't send all Greninja, but he sent a lot of Greninja. So that's cool. We got one Luxray, one Jumbo Shrimp, a whole mess of Greninja, and, and three Schizor. Mega Scizor EX. Scizor. <sighs> What's interesting is that these are actually wrapped with plastic here. Like, they're very difficult to open. I don't know why Walmart did that, but I've noticed even our Walmart's doing that now. Like, I mean, I understand them trying to keep the anti-theft. And, and honestly, you can't weigh breakpoint packs because of the codes from what I've seen and heard from people that I know. Um, you can't weigh these because of the code card difference. Uh, the ones that don't have rares and have a heavier code card. The ones that don't have hollow rares are better. And the ones that do have a lighter code card, so you can't weigh them at it anyway. So why, why the extra plastic? I don't, I don't understand that. Oh well. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up two of these here on camera. And I get the Greninja, right? No, you don't get the Greninja. Where are the scissors? They're right below me. So we actually have to cut through this plastic. I mean, this is kind of tedious. Definitely uh, efficient. Would you like a Twizzler. Haha, uh -huh, I got a bigger piece. 
Thank you. I still have another piece in my hand. Oh, well, no wonder. <laughs> you suck. Anyways. Yeah, so much for um, A plus on the loss prevention there, Walmart. So we're going to save these for future openings, maybe pack battles or something like that. Who knows what we're going to do with them. But we've got two packs that we'll open up here today for you guys on Mega Mailbox Mini Monday, just to add to the fun of this video. Give you guys a bonus opening. All right, there was a Mega Scizor in the Greninja and a Greninja in the Mega Scizor. So that's pretty cool. I'll let you open up the Mega Scizor. Scizor. All righty. And you know what? Here you go. And I got my own Twizzler. Take a code. Because we're cool like that. Every once in a while. I'm cooler. Got Sad Duck Duck. Phantom. Slowpoke. Shanks. Spoitzy. Splash Energy. Potion. Palpitoad. Reverse Hell Swan of Fanta. And Age of McSlash Hollow. Very nice. So you got a hollow out of that. Megaton Slash! Painful Sword. You'd rather use Painful Sword. But Megaton Slash on someone's cooler. It does. But Painful Sword is a better attack if only Age of Slash was in a stage 2 or had a way of evolving faster. Alright, so next up here we've got our pack of Greninja Break. Let's it's see if we can make rare it. Rare Candy. Two for two. I'm gonna give you guys this code because, hey, why not? It's here. Mega, Mega Mailbox Mania Monday. Let us give something back to you for sending us such awesome things. Okay. So one, two, three, one, two, and away we go. All right, we've got a Pharaoh Seed, Trubbish, Electabuzz, Froakie, Rattata, Rat -tat -tat -tat. Grandpa, Grandpa, Grandpa Dunsparce, Durant, Luxio, Reverse Hollow Pancham, and a Meow Stick, non-Hollow Rare. So we did get one Hollow out of that. The rest of them we're gonna save for other openings. So Lewis, thank you so much for coming through on that and sending those to us because obviously you didn't have to do that. But thank you for doing the legwork right, so there. So where is the package I need to use the sword? Uh, that would be. Where is it? Oh, I know what it is because I pre-opened the envelope just to find that there was another envelope, and that's when I saw this. <laughs> this is a TCBM from Papa Blastoise. And here we have, hey Professor KN, tell N to get the sword, you may need it. Do you want to play? I do want to play. That's creepy. So this is the second time someone said, Do you want to play a game? Should I do this? Should I use the power of the keyblade to open it? Or should I use the brute power of the Dark Link Master Sword to open it? Well, I believe he told me. I have me many swords, people. You have to be very careful with it because it is actually very delicate. But right here is a good starting point. If you really want to... Oh gosh, don't try this at home, kids. All right. You got it in there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Don't worry, the edges are completely flat. Oh yeah, they're completely dull. That's not even gonna work. No, no, it's not even dull. <laughs> it's meant to be flat. Okay. So we're oh, just gonna wait, peel wait, the tape wait, off. Wait, 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 wait. It, oh. did, it did its job. Stop, stop, stop. It did its job. Okay, it did. I was gonna open it. So this is for me to open. Well, the trade in there was for me, but... But... Tell him to get the sword to open it. But I'll let you open it. Exactly, it's for me to open. It's still your trade, but it's still for me to open. Okay, go for it. All right. We have lots of, lots of stuff in here. Gosh, we only traded for like one card. What the heck did question he Question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. This is gonna be fun. You oh take two, I take two. All right, I'll open this one first. You may need the sword to get through that tape though. Or not the sword, the scissors. Yeah, get the scissors, because I don't want you hurting whatever's in there. Well, or you can do that. That's not so bad, I guess. Tis what I do. Get this off my finger. What in the world could possibly he have done? Oh, that's the trade. That is the trade. Good guess. Oh. Yes, Secret Rare Charizard from Plasma Storm. So, question, if you decide to use this in a tournament, they all have this misprint here. To use this attack, do you have to have the fighting energy? I don't know. I really don't know if they require you to do it or not. But, I have one of these, however, it has, the one I have has a crease right here, a small crease, very tiny. 
and it's just enough to be not perfect. Um, yeah, so I definitely wanted to trade for that. So that is an awesome trade, thank you very much. This one appears to be in very, very good condition. Considering how you can't take care of your cards. Well, no, actually what it was is I bought it from somebody. When they shipped it to me, they sent it in a piece of cardboard only. No top loader, no sleeve. And when I took it out, it was bent. So, I got bent in shipping, I suppose, because it wasn't properly protected as Papa Blastoise did for this card. Yep, yep. And we have Schnitzel. Uh huh? Custom pack of Schnitzel. Okay. Very interesting code card. I don't know if there's a pack trick or not. Well, let's just not do it. We have Persian, Ball Toy, Golurk, Inke, Relicanth, and Flareon. Okay, cool, cool. Very interesting indeed. And now I believe it is your turn. Okay. I was just taking a look at this Charizard here. I got it out of the sleeve for you guys to really marvel at. It's such a beautiful card. Shiny Charizard, gold borders. The fire adds a nice touch to it. It's about as near mint as you can find in a trade anyways. It does have some edge whiting there, but it's still better than the one I've got. The one I have has edge whiting and it also has that crease. So this is definitely much, much better. I did trade away two gold stars for it. However, they were two gold stars that are pretty low value. That would be Entei and Raikou. They're only worth 20 to $30 a piece right now, which you is still enough. You away gold stars? Yep. This is just as hard to find. It really is. But you already have one. I do, but now I can do something else with that one. Maybe sell it at a lower price or something. I don't know. Maybe it'll be an extra trade gold stars. Vendor. Maybe. I don't know. Entei and Raikou are nice. But they're not my favorite gold stars. I mean, there's certain ones that I'll never give up. Like, probably, I, unless we really, really, really had to, I don't want to give up that Mudkip gold star being the first gold star we've ever pulled. And on the channel, even, that's like, that's like holy grail. So, I got to keep that. Okay, so we have a pack of Ancient Origins, but this appears to be sealed. This, this, I think this is a sealed pack. Yes, it is. All right. So, let's see, uh, shiny primal fish, maybe? Shiny primal fish. Shiny primal fish, let's do it. All right, so we have a code card. On the correct you way. You know what, here you go. Take that code. We don't need it. It was on the correct way, too. It was, that's very rare. One, two, three, one and two. Let's see what we have here in this Ancient Origins pack. We've got a Beldum, Unknown, Porygon, Spinarak, Meowth, Sligoo, Level Ball, Sableye, Reverse Hollow Gumi and a Porygon Z regular rare. Porygon Thank you so much, though. Day. I was not expecting you to send a sealed pack at all, so that's really awesome of you. Definitely appreciate it. We had some playable stuff in here. Unknown is nice and playable. Spinarak and Level Ball, all good cards. And we have one more question mark envelope. And it is taped up quite well, so. I'm scared of this one. We're gonna have to, yeah. I kinda am too, because so far it's been pretty good stuff. Maybe this is the dud. Knowing Papa Blastoise, I feel like there's something in here that we're not going to like. But then again, I, I hope could it's be at wrong. least something you're not gonna like. Oh boy. Let's see. I see another pack inside of here, but is it sealed? It is not sealed. Okay. So that means that there's something in here for us. It's upside down even. Let's see what this is. Here we go. Oh boy. Code card. Oh, okay. Cool. I'm actually going to keep this one. If you guys caught it, great. If not, oh well. So we got a Porygon, an Oddish, a Golurk, Inke, Relicanth, and a Flareon. Okay, so this is a Helioptile and a Halucha free FCBM extra That's along with the That's amazing trade. to hear. That is very amazing. I was fully expecting something, especially with that picture, but this is the star of the show right here. Charizard Secret Rare. Very awesome card. Thank you very much for the trade, my man. Uh, go check out Papa Blastoise. Great Poketuber. Awesome dude. All right, let's keep this moving along here before my camera runs out of space. We have 24 minutes left on the SD card, so we really got to make sure we push it along. Next up here, we have an FCBM from Alex F. Pokemon, also known as Alexander Freeman on YouTube, as well as that is his name. So you guys can go check him out in the link in the description down below as we open this up here. And there's some stuff in here. Some stuff. There's some, some stuff. stuff. Okay. First and foremost, please sign this and send it back. 
Logo! Yeah, very cool. All right, that's our logo. And, oh, we got some drawings. Okay, so we got Greninja for Professor K, the best professor, Alex F. 322 2016 and you got a chibi zorak yay so so Anne isn't left out <laughs> we each have our own fan base what can i say congratulations on 21,000 subscribers 25k will hit fast well, well let's hope so at this particular point in time we are pushing 22,100 subscribers right now that's pretty crazy we've gaining we're gaining like a thousand every two weeks 500 a week so you never know that 25k may happen really quick all right so, N, I'm going to let you read everything else in this. I have to read? Yep. I was not ready for today. All right. Hello, Professor K and N. Ever since the Pokemon Evolution has hit 20,000 subscribers, I have really been interested in the channel to the point where it has inspired me to get back to work on my own channel. I just want to thank you two so much, especially Professor K. Someone's playing favorites here. <laughs> for your time and effort that goes into making the Pokemon Evolution is what it is. I hope too. That said, it has been a long time since I have complied a fan mail, and I hope you enjoy all that I have included. The two packs are custom packs made by myself. The Venusaur is a Professor Case and you need a pack art, and the other is self-explanatory. Save the signals for last, they are labeled as the who's are who's. Also, I very much apologize in advance, and please forgive me later. Keep up the good work. Alex F. Pokemon. Old channel, and just links. Sorry, no custom URL yet. If broken, let me know. Alright. <sighs> So, uh, the Venusaur pack is mine, and the singles, okay, so these are mine, and these are yours. Okay. There you go. Should I go first? Yep. Remove sticky before opening, open from bottom. The thing here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got the Halucha pack. <laughs> I said it open from bottom. Nee. Should I do Patrick? Um, I don't think so. Okay. Yay, Zara! Monkey! Nah. Nah. Okay, monkey. Monkey. Nah. 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 <laughs> Maybe you were supposed to do the pack trick. If I was, I'm sorry, Alex. I forgot. <laughs> Alright, so I got Zora and three monkeys. That's good. Alright, what's your single? My shingo. You, you no. get one card. I get three. <laughs> no peeking. Alright, fine. I won't peek. It is Zoar Galactic Hollow from XY Base. That was one of the ones in a promo blister, as a matter of fact. Yep. The Very one cool. that the cursed Haluchas dare to rip in half. <laughs> they will pay. The Sparkle Army shall raid down a death worse than... I can't even describe it. No physical English language <laughs> words can describe what is coming for these haluchas. All right. So I've got a pack of Venusaur Generations here that is open. I was looking for this pack art because I could not open it very well, but this is about the best that I've seen. So for now, it will be the one that goes in the collection for that reason. And I'm going to do the pack trick because I'm assuming that that's what I was supposed to do. And don't rip it. I see you over there. We've got a Ghastly, a Ghastly, Far Club, and Eevee, Froakie, Froakie, Frogadier, Heavy Ball, Heavy Ball, Froakie, and a Frogadier. Why did you get no Helioptiles? Because Alex and I are friends. <laughs> That's why. And we don't even know what's in this, so it's hard to say what is in store for me after we get this open. All right, so let's go. Okay, this is still backwards. Oh, very cool. Okay, so we got the X and Y Callow Starter Set Greninja Hollow. We've got... Oh, the Froakie and the Frogadier, also from the X and Y Kalos starter kit. Okay. All right. Helioptile free. I like it. I like it a lot. I don't like it. Very cool. Helioptiles must be welcome with open arms here. <laughs> well, that's just too bad. All right. Thank you very much, Alex, for sending that. Do appreciate it. We're compiling quite a mess here on the table. But we are down now to our final FCBM from Ganon's collection. I think he said he was going to send this quite a while ago. And... Um, it took quite a while, but that's okay. We don't mind. We got a stack of codes here, so we'll be opening these up on stream at some point. Trade. Before you, everything enjoy. Trade. I don't remember saying a trade. I'm going to have to ask what we were trading for because I don't remember. 
Um, oh, wow. <laughs> this is the metal energy from Call of Legends that we were looking for on our Weebly website. Weebly, Weebly, Weebly! Oh, and the reverse fighting energy, or the hollow fighting energy. Um, this is not going to come off here very well, so you know what? I'm just going to reach in here and take them out one by one. There it is. This is such a great looking energy with the Steelix in the background. Very cool. Very highly sought after energies. Just as much as, well, more than generations will be, I'm sure, but still. Pseudowoto in the background there for the fighting type. So that's cool. Thank you very much. I'll have to see what we were supposed to do for that because I really don't remember. All right. So we have SIG cards. N in the front and K in the back. So N. <laughs> <laughs> the slow blow lives on Ganon's I collection. I hate you, V. V Decepticon. <laughs> the one V Decepticon you. is responsible for that. Yes, that's great. So you get slow blow. What do I get? I get Froki. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone hates N. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, that's cool. Thank you very much for the sig cards. And oh, okay. Uh oh no. Look, and the better one. See. Yay. You're okay. You're fine. You're fine. All right. So, um, open last. I, I don't know because this says open second. I guess that's supposed to be me. Let's go with that. We're going to cut the tape off of here because there is tape everywhere on that side, on that side, and on that side, and also on the bottom. All right. Tape everywhere. Tape everywhere. Ooh. Okay. There's some good stuff there. All right. So, we've got some code cards. Thank you. Thank you. They will definitely be open on stream. Appreciate that. And in here we have Greninja. Oh, we got a couple of Greninja. Okay, cool. So these are non hollow rare Greninjas. Very playable. Shadow Stitching and Moonlight Slash. Greninja. And then we have. Whoa. Ooh. Hello. A Rayquaza EX from Ray Roaring Quay, Skies. Ray, Ray oh. And a Kiram EX from Ancient Origins. Ice Cream oh, Dragon. Man. Thank you so much. That is awesome of you. Really do appreciate that. Very, very cool. Nice. Very nice. Wow. All right. So what did you get in? Let's see. All right. So cut my sides. Oh, wait. Mines aren't going to cut. They should. There's no gap to cut. All right. So I'm just going to rip and just try my luck. Come on. Come on. Uh, okay, okay, I think right here I can get the scissors. Oh, I see something good. I, so do I. Yeah, uh, come on. Well, there you go. There's <laughs> the larval fish the larval in fish. his glory. <laughs> uh, might as well tape so shut together. Well, I mean, it's it is the larval fish. He deserves all the protection he can get. That's very true. You got it. You got to protect the primal fi or the larval fish. You do have to protect the larval fish. Because you got to think about it, once he's primal, he don't need no protection. No, not at all. You need protection from him. Yes, absolutely. All right, so going to get tape off before I go anywhere else with this. And it ripped in half. <laughs> and struggling with packs and tape. Is there anything I don't struggle with? Life. You struggle with life. Oh, don't struggle with. Oh, oh, sorry. My bad. <laughs> I hate you. Oh, whoa, all kinds whoa, of stuff. Whoa, whoa. What, 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 what happened? I didn't see it. A lot of stuff spilled. We got Meowstic. That's cool. Meowstic is definitely, definitely cool. Whoa. 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 Hey. Full art thunderous. Whoa. That's pretty. What? And a Zoark. A good one. The very playable Zoark. Yes. That is awesome. Ugh. And I see MVP. Jeez. Well, you're getting the love here. And you got and a regular Gallade. Dang. Oh, look at that. Look at that other card in the back of the. There yeah, the Machamp. Go. That Machamp is a promo. That is Wizards of the Coast promo number 43, I think. Yep. Wow. Very, very cool. And the Meowstic on top of that just because Meowstic's cool, but yeah. Well, you may have gotten the slow blow card, but you sure did not get slow blow cards. No, I did not. <laughs> the signature card, anyways, you get. Wow. Very nice. Very Thank nice. Thank you so much, man. This is awesome. Shout out to Ganon's collection. His link will be in the description down below as well because he also has a channel. Oh, yes, definitely. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Yeah, I got the very powerful Zoroark here. 
Very cool. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for this version of Mega Mailbox Mania Monday. Very good week. Very awesome stuff here. So thank you to everyone who submitted to us. We appreciate all of you. And if you're interested in ever sending us anything, you guys can contact me at PokemonEvolutionaries at gmail.com. And we will figure out how you guys can work something out with that and be featured here on an episode of Mega Mailbox, Mail Mega Mega Mailbox Mania Monday yourself. We love you all. Ooh, man, that is a mouthful. And RIP, never forget... Poor Halucha. The war is on. You can see through it. <laughs> the war has been declared. It's the Christmas Halucha because he's holy. <laughs> Terrible joke. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that like button, comment down below, and of course, subscribe for more TCG content here on the Pokemon Evolutionaries. We appreciate you all. We love you for all the support and all of this amazing stuff that you guys send to us. It's feel more than I feel like we ever deserved. So you guys are great. Thank you so much. Anyways, guys, we will see you next time. As I said, look out for Two Pack Tuesday tomorrow. Not going to be Dragon Frontiers or Holland Phantoms because of the video issues, but there will be something, so stay tuned for that. And we will see you guys there. I'm Professor K. And I'm Ed. For the Pokemon Evolutionaries. See you all next time, and take care.